Hello everyone, my name is Madison, oh, welcome back to Hop and Help, and I have some very, very exciting news. I proudly present Fifi's Creations Commissions. So many of you have seen my great plate stud Fifi creating paintings for you guys, but now you can customize them the way you want. From Friday, February 5th to Friday, February 26th, I'm going to be accepting commissions for Fifi to make you a painting the way that you'd like it. And I have lots of new stuff to introduce. So first, I'm going to introduce a new type of painting that you can order. So there are 3 by 3 canvases and 3.5 by 2.5 which is just going to be a landscape version of this guy. And the new template is going to be the cheapest option which is a cardstock square with a Polaroid frame. So Fifi can make you your own custom Polaroid picture. There are over 35 different different colors to choose from. You can select having a background, the different sizes of splotches, different patterns, you name it. It is all on this form and you can completely customize your painting. Now this is a limited time event. It's only going to be in the month of February because this is kind of an unusual thing for a toad to do. Fifi itself is my top priority. Everything I'm doing here is comfortable for Fifi and is going to suit his needs. And since this isn't really a normal thing, I'm only doing it in February because he likes to come out, but I don't want him to come out that much because it can cause stress, even though I think he'd do about anything for a cricket. But real fast before we get into Fifi painting, I'd like to talk about the safety precautions I take for my amphibians. The number one thing is the paint doesn't actually touch Fifi. The paint is, there's no safe paint for amphibians. Everything that an amphibian touch gets absorbed through their skin and there's just quite literally nothing safe for them that is like paint. Like I know you can paint with snails, but it's not the same with amphibians. So in order to make this safe for your amphibians, you need something that contains the paint. Now I'm a huge advocate to cut down on single use plastic. In the last video, I used Ziploc bags that I ended up throwing out and I really didn't like that, especially if I was going to make this a month long thing. So I purchased reusable Ziploc bags. Now these are non-toxic, completely safe for Fifi. And really all I do is, you know, slide the canvases in, seal it real nice and good, and then it is safe. It is actually more safe than Ziploc bags because this is super durable and there's going to be absolutely no way that paint gets through this. So after I seal it up, I wash everything off, including the table, and then it is safe for Fifi to come out after I have removed all of the paints. Then I place Fifi back into his enclosure, open up the bags and take the canvases out, and then I just turn these inside out and wash them out so they can be reused again so there is no single-use plastic at all in this process. So again, if you had any concerns or if you'd like to try this with your amphibian, the paint cannot touch your frog or reptile or anything. It must be contained in a bag and you need to make sure there is no residue or anything like that. But now I think it's time to get onto the painting. And here is our wonderful chunky artist. Fifi, are you ready? Okay, I think he's ready. So prior to getting him out, I have thoroughly cleaned my hands and thoroughly cleaned off the table. There is no paint residue whatsoever and he is ready to eat some crickets and smear some paint. <laughs> All right, Fifi. Do your thing. Oh, he wants to eat Caleb, come here. Ooh, that was a good one. Look at him, he's going crazy today. Oh. He's like, sorry, my bad. Yeah, foot stamp.
Fifi, you did a really good job. I'm very proud of you. Oh, okay. No, let's not get that close. I think everyone is gonna love your paintings, okay? You did a good job. Now time to go sit in your water bowl and do nothing for the rest of the day, because you deserve it. Boop. And now that Fifi is away, we can open up the paintings, but first, I think I actually need to clean his eco-earth off, unless you guys want some free coconut substrate with your paintings. about you but I think these paintings turned out absolutely amazing. Now mind you this was kind of an experiment because I wasn't sure how the Ziploc bags that I got were going to affect it. I'm definitely going to make it so that it's just one painting per bag because it kind of smeared it a little bit especially with the design one. But if you're interested in one of these paintings or Fifi to make you a custom one please check out the link above or down in the description below. Now this is limited time it's only for the month of February so please go quickly. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did leave a like and subscribe for more and have a happy day. Goodbye.